Welcome, welcome, welcome. Resident Evil. Resident Evil. Revelations. Revelations. Set me, chat. Yes, I finally got it. Hope you're all doing well. Connecting to the network. I just launched this game and I just literally got the blue screen. The error blue screen. So, uh, not a good sign. Not a good start. If I'm being honest. So, hopefully that is a one-time occurrence. Because... I lucky I wasn't lucky I didn't hit record already. Uh, Russ, I would have been pretty mad. <coughs> Crosshair color. <coughs> what do you reckon? Red display tutorial subtitles on map display on. I don't know how this handles uh, controls wise, we should actually check. <coughs> oh, aiming speed. Oh, there you go, there, details. Okay, uh, classic one. Walk. Rotate, strafe, quick turn. Oh, they got the quick turn back. Use herb, use knife, use sub weapon, reload. Ready. Aim. Wait, aim the weapon as R2? That's weird. No? And so to aim and shoot is R2 and square. No, hell no, that's too weird. Yeah, this is better. Shoot a one. Yeah, shoot a one. Walk, rotate. Yeah, that's better. Strafe, quick turn. Use herb, use knife, sub weapon. Reload as square. Yeah, shoot a one. Definitely. Definitely shoot a one. I'm good. I uh, got up early. Oh, I went to I went to bed pretty early last night. So tired. Uh, raid mode, cooperative mode where you fight enemies of varying difficulty. No, just campaign. Uh, got up. Got a uh, had some breakfast. Uh, infernal difficulty provides a hearty challenge. Uh, I'll just get casual because I'm a noob. Newbie. Uh, yeah, I got up. I uh, had something to eat. Uh, just, um... I watched XQC play this video. Play this game. Um, Survive until Friday, I think it was called. I didn't watch all of it, but it looks really good. But I, I actually looked it up on the PlayStation Store, but it's not there. It's, uh... One of those PC-only games, I think. Bobbies. Hey, Jill. Oh, with Jill Valentine in this. Yeah, so we're playing chronologically, so this takes place timeline wise after five. Ah, uh, sorry, after four. Which is what we, which was the last one we played. The Queen's and all. This thing is lucky to be afloat. <clears throat> Take us around. Let's find a boarding point. Survive until Friday. It's like a um, first person. You're like kidnapped in a room, and you have to like escape and sort of run away from the kidnapper and like. Uh, but you have like five days. To sort of survive, Ras on the fifth day, he just like kills you. It's like a cutscene. <coughs> like I said, it looks really good, but 
Casey only. It's been 94 minutes since Chris and Jessica dropped off the radar. But the interpolation from their last known coordinates puts them right here on the ship. Who's this? I don't know who this is. Use a herb after taking the okay. So, oh, I was going to say, please let me control for her and not this random. I have no idea who this guy is. Ah, oh, it's better. How do we run? No running? <laughs> oh. So, who am I? Jill Valentine. Okay, so, but yeah, basically the same character from Resi 3. So this is after, obviously, her battle with, um... I might be able to shoot it off. Nemesis. Yoink. This feels so different. Like, this... It's been abandoned for a while. I don't know what it is. It I mean, it feels good, don't get me wrong, but it feels like, uh, like comparing this to other Resi games, it feels a lot smoother. Who's dead? I did this to him. <coughs> Although, this is me coming from playing Resident Evil 4, which was very janky. Do I have a, uh, okay, so this is my inventory, ammo, key items. Basic manual for the game, the map. Oh, I do not know about this map. This map is like, uh, if you've seen any of the um, the Doom Eternal um, videos, it, it, the the map looks very like Doom, Doomish. I think the old Doom had a map like this as well. Not the old, old, old Doom, I'm talking about the the one that came out a few years ago. No signs of life. But I feel like something's here. Yeah. Hey. Oh, I saw that. What happened? I don't think we're alone. That doesn't look like just water. Coom? Can I climb up there? Lovely. Uh, but yeah, I was thinking, like, if you were a, uh, if you were, like, a video game developer, would you not want your game on, would you not want your game on every single platform, device, console available? Like, that just makes sense to me. Yeah. Say. So, say so, yeah. Say what you will about Fortnite, but this is one of the good things about Fortnite. There's it can be played by anyone ducks. on any device, console, PC, no power. mobile. Which means no elevator for us. When the Switch was released, they put it on the Switch, which is very bad, by the way. Fortnite on the Nintendo Switch is so bad. It's um, I've never seen a mutation like this. It's not working. <clears throat> yeah, her hair looks much longer in this game. I'm not sure the, uh, yeah, I'm not sure how many years this is a waste of ammo. Those are some big fucking rats. I'm not sure how many years this is after Rizzy. The power three. still works here. I'm sure Google can answer that. It's shorted out. Is that a hatch in the floor? Oh.
die, die, die. Jill, take a look at this. Jill, I still don't know who the fuck this Parker, guy is. Give me a hand here. Sure. Parker, no. okay. <laughs> he must just be a new character, I think. Your weapon. I got something. I think it's a gun. Now what? Give me a sec. Skin tight jumpsuit. Yeah. So it's not Chris. Someone's spying on my booty. Uh, you might want to turn around. <laughs> what was that? I didn't get a chance to read it. It popped up and I just saw the word ammo. planes are missing crew. <laughs> This is not good. Where are you, Chris? Where are you, Chris? Episode 1, Into the Depths. Yeah, the revolu uh, the the revolution, the revelations games are episodic. Apparently, apparently, the, I think the second one's episodic as well. Like Telltale, yeah, like Telltale. <coughs> this sunny and idyllic Mediterranean coast was the site of one of the world's greatest structures. It took a full eleven years to finish constructing the world's first Aquapolis, the floating city of Terra Grigia. A sustainable metropolis operating on a massive solar energy matrix and equipped with the latest green technologies. Never that's what that's what the, that's what the future is going to look like. Used to people. supply power to an entire city. A but city going to be run on Veltro, solar power. A terrorist group opposing the city's development launched a bioterrorist attack. T-virus. They not only released a virus, but also several creatures, known as bio-organic weapons, further complicating the situation. BRWs. This launched one of the worst tragedies the world has ever seen. The FBC, Those are hunters, right? The world's leading counter-bioterror organization, operating under the auspices of the U.S., was called in to direct efforts to contain the attack. The BSAA, a counter-bioterror NGO, which operates independently of the interests Morgan of any Lansdale. one country, went in as observers to assist the FBC. Realizing the need for immediate and decisive action, Supreme Local Headquarters issued the order to use the city's solar energy matrix on itself. Media outlets around the world began oh, they destroyed to the whole city the as the Terra Grigia panic. Following the incident, the FBC announced it has successfully disbanded the terrorist group called Veltro. It is now 2005, and a sense of calm and security is finally returning to the people. But, as you can see, the lost city of Terra Grigia remains inaccessible. A silent and potent symbol of the threat that bioterror poses for people around the world. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna be back at four o'clock. Four o'clock, uh, with the suicide of Rachel Foster. I might hit that in uh, one hit. I think it's like three and a half hours long, maybe. Ah, there you two are. O'Brien, you don't normally join the fray. Well, my doctor told me I need exercise. <laughs> I assume you both know that the FBC has cordoned off the entire area. 
However, in the past few weeks, a number of mysterious carcasses have washed up. I guess the FTC couldn't cover up a mess this big, huh? Anyone who knows what happened here is going to put two and two together. And that's why I oh. sent the BSAA in to investigate. Did you pick up your new equipment from Clint? Yeah. Uh, Genesis uh, something. Is that its name? You didn't bother to read the manual, did you? No. Uh, I brought it with me. Just in case. I hope you read quickly. Because you're gonna need it on your mission. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it. <laughs> I pulled it out of my ass. <laughs> Z manual. Oh, 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 okay. Genesis Manual, version 109. Genesis, the nickname of a high-level bioscanner currently being tested and developed by the Global Pharmaceutical Consortium. It bounces special synch synchrotron radiation off of a target in order to analyze it. Viral analysis. It is possible to detect and analyze even the smallest amount of viruses. Vaccine manufacturing. Since version 104, it has been... Impossible. Uh, it has been possible to produce simple vaccines from the viral analysis data detection using synch synchrotron radiation. It is possible to detect specific objects. The data for bullets, medicinal herbs, etc., registered within the internal memory for testing. If we, if a detachable object is nearby, the indicator in the lower right area of the monitor will light up. Okay. <clears throat> Ah, look at this mess. Oh, they're rotted to hell. It's such a weird game. Like, I feel like it's a, uh, like, I'm so used to Resi games sort of, like, being on my own. I mean, the game's just started, but I feel it's a little bit different now that you're with people off the start. Skin so pale. I've never seen anything like it. Use the Genesis to get a reading on it. Yeah, you don't really hear much of the Umbrella Corp since uh, two and three and one. A Genesis requires a decent sample size to get an accurate reading. Scan the carcasses on the beach and send me your data. Trying to get to know the real me? Oh yeah. Have a look at this. Metal detected. I'm getting something from inside it. Maybe another gun. Careful now. Don't worry. I've done this before. I've got something. Incendiary grenade. What right. is this? If it's an engineered mutation, this could prove a link. I'll run some tests on this. Continue with the investigation. Why do I feel like that was a big mistake, handing him that? You're gonna betray us, huh? You're gonna betray me? Got my own Not bitch. There. That's where Terry Grigio was. Has it been a year already? Stop fooling around. Sorry, what? Okay, so bring up the map. Oh. Okay, I can't look at my map. I guess I just gotta keep scanning this shit. Oh God! The thing has fucking teeth. After Raccoon City, this must be a cakewalk. I suppose. So why'd you quit the FBC for this outfit? I wanted to be more involved. 
I wanted to fight. I see you two are okay. Continue with the oh, Raccoon City. With extreme Memories. Uh, that smell must have ruptured from gas. Christ, what a mess. Not sure where my health is. Newspaper from last year. It's the first article bringing the existence of BOWs to the public. <clears throat> oh, totally missed that. Sub weapon controls. Use the weapon with R1. Use weapon while aiming with L2, R1. Switch weapons. We don't have enough data to run a complete analysis. Gather some more samples from the carcasses on the beach. Oh! Okay, well, that was a waste. Have I not scanned everything? Maps still not available. <clears throat> oh, I'm 5% off. 95%. Okay, so there must be a little blob somewhere. I've already scanned this one. Ah, oh, right there. Ah, oh, that's one bit though. Okay, that counts as one. God, look at these dead fish. It's like flat into the ground. Oh, ammo. Good thing I came back. I don't pay you to play. I pay you to work. Yeah, I'm fucking... What do you think I'm doing? Oh! This one here. I don't think I scanned this one. There we go. I've collected enough samples. Good. Get it. What was that that just popped up? Oh, you have a limit of shit you can carry. Well, that's annoying. You can only carry two herbs, but it looks like the inventory is completely different, though. You just have the items and then the number. To me ASAP. <clears throat> there you are. Nice work. <coughs> no doubt about it. These corpses show signs of viral infection. And I bet it's no coincidence they came through the FPC's blockade. Well, we did all we can. Now we wait for the results to come back from HQ. Huh? It's the emergency line. 
Yeah, it's me. Uh-huh. What? Yes, that's fine. I'll take it from here. We'll have to speed things up. Starting now. Uh-huh. Bad news? Good. Get to it. Jill, Parker. You two are still on the case. What happened? We lost contact with Chris and Jessica. When? How? We're not certain. I've sent their last known coordinates to your terminals. Wait, is this a flashback? The signal was lost over the ocean. I thought they were in the mountains chasing Feltro. But judging from their position, they must be... On a ship. This must be a flashback. HQ. Take okay. charge of the search and rescue. You two will be my eyes out there. Yes, sir. Because when we started, we started on a ship and she was looking for Chris. CS. Oh man, I'm excited to play this. After playing Resident Evil 4 for so long. You think these things got to Chris and Jessica? Which is a pretty long game not. as well. Hey, I'm excited to get through this, which is supposed to be pretty short in Resident right. Evil then let's find him already. comparisons. And then start 5. And then Resident Evil Revelations 2 is apparently short as well. Did you hear that? Was that the lock? <clears throat> I'll check it out. Okay. I'll see... Ah, oh, hence why my map wasn't working. I didn't need it because I was just on the little island. Ah. Current location. Weapon box. Doors that can't be opened yet. Doors that can be opened. What I can find here. Copy that. I'll radio you if I pick up Chris's trail. Oh, yeah. Search for Chris. I'm actually going to... I've never seen a creature like this. I'll use the Genesis to examine it. Oh. This thing finds items as well. This thing has a lot of similarities to the corpses on the beach. Handgun ammo. Oh. More ammo, which I can't carry. I'm actually going to change... There we go. Face cam is blocking some shit. I don't want to put top right because then it would block the map. Oh fuck, this is covering up. Alright, now I can see my ammo. Chris! Chris! Is that you? Chris! Come on, say something! Lady, the guy's dead. Alright. I found Chris, but he's trapped in there. Can you get him out? No, it's a tough lock. I need the key. Okay, then let's find it. Restart options. I'm just seeing if I can save it at any time, but I don't think I can. At the end of every episode, maybe, or there might be a uh, tape recorders that lets you save.
camera controls. Nope. No. Wait, that's aiming. Swimming controls. Nope. I don't think that changed the uh, the camera speed. I think it only changes the aiming speed. I hear it. I'm just waiting to open one of these lockers and a body to fall out. Like Resi 2? Yeah, in the police station. This place is a mess. I do love how they've implemented the quick turn. Lock, there's an anchor mark on the door. Okay, anchor key. Locked, lock it, lock it. A woman screaming, I'm sure it's fine. Oh! Can I scan through the window? Oh, I wasn't quick enough. I wanted to shoot the glass and throw a grenade in there. Oh, they're just having a feast. Thank you. So you search that instead of turning like this. Bang! Nothing here. Bang! Okay. I want to hit these cunts with a grenade. Oh, okay. It auto saves. Wait, no, I picked those grenades up at the beach. I don't have it anymore. <laughs> Fuck. What was the point of picking that up? Oh, okay. Did you hear me? So she's not a survivor. What? I'm still trying to piece that together. Jesus! No wonder they had a munch. Holy shit! Nothing on the table. Nope. The BOWs obviously don't realize no means no. There's nothing that could identify her. Let's see what the Genesis can tell me. Well, I tried to scan her before. It said no target. Item. Crew quarters, area key. Park. Menu? I couldn't find anything out on the woman, but I did find a key. 
Let's try it out. I'll meet you in the crisis room. See you there. Wait for it. Wait there it is. Jesus Christ. Anytime you come one way, clear the area, and then come back the same way, enemies. Music's picking up. Wait a minute. Current location, anchor door. Wait, I think I went the wrong way. Oh no. Fuck. Wait a minute. I don't think I scanned this one. There we go, 100%. I don't know what that is. Is that like health? I don't know. Every time you hit 100%, I get another pill. Fuck man, I need some ammo. That's gonna be annoying, you gotta scan every single enemy. Where the fuck am I going? I've definitely gone the wrong way. There's my grenade. What are you doing in the dryer? I feel like the headshots aren't... I feel like the headshots aren't necessary. Like, I feel like a headshot is... Like, I feel like a body shot does more, like, the same sort of damage as a headshot. Oh, I should be... I should be doing this more often. I just keep thinking to just scan the enemies, forgetting about the rooms. Okay. I guarantee you there's like item in there. I guarantee you there'll be a bunch of shit that uh 
pops up. Destination, current location. Doors that can be opened. So I need to go downstairs, which is actually back this way, I think. Handgun ammo, yeah. I feel like... Oh. I feel like otherwise... Yeah, see this is where I'm finding all my ammo. Otherwise I feel like I'm gonna just run out of ammo. Badly. More ammo? good that it picks up through like walls and doors and shit. Every bullet counts. Oh wait, I must have max bullets. 30 or 30, I do. Okay. Uh, which way did I go? This way? No wonder I didn't know where Chris was. It was fucking downstairs. Dude, oh god, just get the shit out we of me. Gotta help Chris. 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 You're not Chris. Oh, not anymore. It's a dummy. It's what fake. Is this? Shall we destroy their, uh, uh, oh, well. Oh. Shit! It's a trap! <laughs> Wait, Wesker? I feel like we haven't seen much of Wesker at all in the Resi games. It's time you learned the truth, Miss Valentine. Episode 1, Into the Depths. Accuracy, 82%. I'm not sure how many episodes are in this. Previously on Resident Evil Revelations. Previously on Lost. Jessica. The signal was lost over the ocean. Queen Zenobia. Fuck, how just say? Right here on this ship. No signs of life. But I feel like something's here. I think it's a gun. <laughs> this is not good. Where are you, Chris? Chris! What is this? Oh, great. Shit! <laughs> it's a trap! <laughs> it's time you learned the truth. It's Valentine.
slow down, Chris. We're almost there, Jessica. I certainly hope so. Sorry about that. My feet are killing me. Our source indicates the camp is on the far side of this peak. Oh, wait, Chris and... Wait, we're playing as Chris now. But I still can't make contact with HQ. Uh, what was the name of this woman we were missing with? Here for so long. Jessica, I think it was. Okay, what do you have? Shotgun and handgun. He can carry 80 handgun bullets. That's good. Um. Shit. Wait a minute. I, I have two weapons now. I can't remember how to... Controls. Details. Sub weapon. Knife. Herb. Sub weapon R1. I don't know. I do not know. Oh, do you have one of these? Oh, you do. Okay. Let me just check the snow. Okay. I'm pretty sure Jess. Oh, the plane! I was gonna say, why is my, my controller God. vibrating so hard? There should be um, shipping routes in this area. Jessica must be a new character the as well. We got on Veltro was on the money. Come on. Oh, I like your weapon, sniper rifle. Head for the crash site. Got myself a marksman over here. Jesus, no one could have lived through that. Investigate the site. Let me know if you find anything. Oh, oh. A crash plane. Surely there's going to be a bunch of items on here. Shotgun shells. Handgun. Whatever did this, it wasn't what human. How are they carrying? A BOW more than likely. That won't work without a key. Oh, there's no items in these boxes. I guess I shouldn't break them open. Oh, what do you know? Herb. Ammo. Max ammo. Wasn't there a, uh, a magnifying glass that popped up? I could have swore a magnifying glass popped up. We should check out the plane more thoroughly. See what we find. chat I've just gotta send my hours through wait I can't move what's happening okay that's weird we should check out the plane more thoroughly oh. see what we find okay wait I just mate I went over that fucking plane with a fine tooth comb the finest of combs Also, I'm pretty sure I'm Chris Redfield. 
right? Which means I'm in charge. Okay. Oh. I don't take orders from you, lady. Fine. We'll go back to the crash site. Oh, what is this? On handling the new prototype, there will be a new prototype introduced on this mission. All mission participants are urged to use extreme caution. When handling the special prototype, all instructions by the handler must be followed to the letter. Isn't it the latter? L-A-T-T? -T? Okay. In the event of an emergency, follow the contingency guidelines in the Hazards and Emergencies Manual. Once the prototype's abilities have activated, it will be impossible to control them. The prescribed sedative must be administered every hour during transport. While it is possible to control the special prototype, its behavior in the field cannot be accurately predicted. When control is no longer viable, please contact HQ on the dedicated line. Is it just me or am I hearing like a scraping noise, beeping noise? No, it's not really a beep noise. Yeah, we searched that. Is that the only thing I was missed? It's marked with the biohazard symbol. Found oh, it's some faint traces of a virus here. Okay, we good to go? He might have been Veltro, I better use the Genesis. I was gonna use it anyway. Picked up the flight plan. The manifest should give us a lead to work with. Let's see. Oh, a handprint. If that's where they are. One of thirty. This mine should take us there. Oh god, is that just like collectible bullshit? Um uh, go through the mine, okay. Jessica, I need a hand. Hold on. <sighs> this cave is too cold. You should have worn your thermal underwear. Me? No, I heard nothing. Of course I fucking heard it. I think the whole fucking mountain heard it. Oh. Oh! I'm gonna reload! Oh, thanks for the save. Looks that way, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, you have to scan have to those while they're either hurt. alive or dying, because then they just disappear. Fucking hell, they took a bloody hit. Wolf with, like, uh, bat wings. Come on, pick it up! Pick it up! Pick it up! Oh. Ah. Reload, reload, reload. That's like a bigger one. Holy shit!
Hang on, I just want to get. Uh, I still have one herb left. BOW decoy, a grenade type sub weapon. Once it's the ground, it lets out a unique sound that lures in surrounding enemies and then explodes. Taking out everything in the vicinity, very effective if used correctly. Should I throw it here? I'm guessing they're all hiding. I'm guessing they're going to jump out. Could it be? Woo! Dead. I need to remember how to use. Oh god. Go towards it! Go towards it! Put it away, put it away! Jesus Christ. That's actually really handy. Um, I'm guessing I have a pistol, but I don't... Wait, do I have a pistol? I'm trying to look. I have a pair of scissors on my fucking ass. Oh, I do. In my holster in the... Ah, like that. Okay. I was just getting worried in case I do run out of shotgun shells. BOW decoy. Hang on, Emma. what stay focused she was your partner before right yeah my partner from before what about it I was, you know just asking really you sound jealous another handprint what too far If it was too far, would it not just not pick up, pick it up at all? I might, um... Oh. Might use my pistol for a bit. Ah, herb. Fuck are we? Oh no! Oh hell no, that was gonna happen. Chris, are you okay? What am I looking for? What am I looking for? my leg. I'm not going anywhere for a while. Can I get up? I only can use my pistol here. Too many of them. Shit, my ammo 
Ah! Are there any more Go towards it! I'm throwing my decoys! Let him run to it. Yeah, you ain't joking. I got no more decoys! What has taken this woman so long? Quit fucking howling. Oh, come on! Oh, I really wish- oh, oh, help me! I need to reload. It's too many. Oh, wait. I can't turn that far. Get in front of me. I can't look behind me. Shoot this thing. Shoot. Oh, my. Can you stand? Holy shit. Thanks. I'll be okay. Oh wait, I still have. Sorry to bring this up again, but. Oh, did I just waste what that? Up? Oh no. Do you trust me as much as Jill? There's no need to compare. I trust you both. Besides, trust is built through actions, not words. Yeah, and the actions you just showed me there were sort of kind of questionable. Okay, well, I wasted so much fucking... It wasn't really a waste, but... Oh, I'm gonna swap back to my shock. I just got tired of running past handgun ammo and not being able to pick it up. So I thought I might as well use it for a little bit. Oh, shit. This is the way we have to go. In that case, I just want to quickly head over here, scan the area for a bit. Nope, okay. I'm just trying to think what game Chris Redfield was in last. I think it was Resi 1, wasn't it? Look, is that the airstrip? Because 2 is out. Leon and Jill. Ah, sorry, Claire Valentine, the sister. 3 was. This is Forkball. Do you read? Jill. Chris here. I read you, sir. And then you, you had 4, right? which was Leon. The interference here killed our signals. We're at Valcoin and Mock Airport. Damn it. It's all a setup. What do you mean? I sent Jill and Parker to the Mediterranean on faulty intel, and now I've lost contact with them. I haven't heard from them since. How? What's going on? Chris, you better look at this. So he's obviously not at the ocean. Possible. O'Brien, you're not gonna like this. We found the Veltro crest. Then stories of their resurrection are true. If that's the case, then. Then the setup that got Jill and Parker. It was all. Yeah, I'd almost guarantee it. O'Brien, we'll go after Jill and Parker. I hope that's not a problem. Not at all. Make your way to the Mediterranean and we'll keep you posted. Any idea what's going on? We'll sort it out later. We have to move. Okay, so he's basically sending them to the ship. Still zero deaths.
A for accuracy. Guest cabin. Wakey, wakey. Oh, what's wrong with her eyes? What? Oh, where the what? fuck are we? Oh, wait, we're in the guest cabin. It just told me. Do you? Parker. Where are you? I am in I don't guest know. cabin. A room, I think. Somewhere on the ship. Damn it. Bastard took all my weapons. Yeah, he took all of mine too. Zero ammo. God damn it. Can you reach HQ? No. Comms are as it seems. We should regroup. Escape the room. Okay, but first. Oh, I don't even have my scanner thing anymore. Okay. Oh. Where am I? It could be worse, Jill. You could have woken up with no clothes on. Feeling violated. It's still on. This room is absolutely filthy. Green herb. Looks like it's been broken for a while. There's dried blood on it. Definitely ain't popping a squat on that toilet. It's filled with dirty water. There might be something at the bottom. Do you want to drain the tub? Well, not necessarily, but... Screwdriver. Is that my weapon, or is that for a, a tool? Some sort of... Oh, I think it's going to be a weapon. Uh, oh my god, I'm stuck in here and I have nothing. A Phillips head screwdriver. Oh wait, I have my knife! Oh wait, fuck. Some dialogue came out and I don't even know what the fuck. No. Oh, I, I had no idea what the fuck that said. I don't even have my knife! Get back in the cupboard, boy. Now it's not time for that. What? Kind of is the, oh, do I need the screwdriver for that fucking? Ah, oh, I want to know what that dialogue was. It pop. For fuck's sake! What am I using the screwdriver for? Something popped up on the screen that I had to read, and it just vanished as soon as it popped up. You can't come in here, right? Eh? Oh yeah, I've got one herb. Screwdriver, I can't equip the screwdriver, I can't do nothing with said screwdriver. Is this really where I'm going to die for the first time? For some bullshit like this? Oh no, big scary monster. Yoink! Ah! Oh, God. What am I using the screwdriver for? Help me, please. Oh, what's in the box? Nothing? I think it's locked. Fucking bullshit! Oh god. Oh, 
Oh god, he's out of the TV. I should be able to get to the bridge through here. What the fuck happened? I just... I had my weapons. Oh, you think, Jill Valentine? You wish you had your weapons. Okay, dodge. Hello, 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 hello. Jill, you can't fight without a weapon. Just do your best to dodge. How do you? I'm pretty sure I didn't see a thing for dodging in here. Strafe, quick turn. No. That was like a cutscene! So you just had to get grabbed by the TV, and she just automatically dodges. And I had a feeling I needed the screwdriver for that... Oh god, I'm trapped in the fucking toilet. I'm gonna die in the shitter. Nah, too slow. She, she just automatically dodged and he goes into the TV. And I knew I needed the screwdriver for that box that was by the door. Even though I kept saying now's not the time for that. I was like, what else is the screwdriver going to be for? <gasps> a shotgun. That would be useful. There's a place to insert something. Oh, I wish I had that thing. God, imagine this fucking shit on hard. Like, There's something unsettling about the waves. I say that every time I play an RE game. Oh, God, imagine doing this shit on hard difficulty. Oh, it doesn't even give me the option to open it. I was just looking at it thinking, I really don't want to open that in case another monster just falls out. Okay, that's good. Uh, but I don't know where the fuck I am. Doors that can't be opened. Upper cabins. Quarter deck. Oh, this is where I was before. And I'm all the way over here now. There's no destination. But I don't know what this grey looks like an elevator, maybe. Go, 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 go. Where would you store my weapons? If I were to kidnap a female soldier on a ship who's loaded with weapons. Are you eating something, or are you humping the floor? Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Wow, this looks marvellous. Such a warm glow. It's very inviting. Oh! Jill, you, you got okay? my weapons? You got a weapon? I'm fine, but the ship's crawling with BOWs. Let's have dinner real quick. We're going to need our weapons. I think I saw them on my way here, but I couldn't reach them. We should be okay as long as we work together. Retrieve weapons. What the fuck is this? There's a hell mark on the fence. Uh, retrieve weapons. It's basically upper. Cafeteria, upper cabins. But it's underneath, though. Um, I'm guessing douchebag. Wait, where'd he go? I go over. I can't even remember his name. Another anchor door. Don't have the key. Parker, I think it was. I'm tell you, I'm guessing Parker doesn't have his weapon either.
Wait, where the fuck is Parker? He literally just said work together and he's just gone. Oh, you're up. Okay, so at least I know roughly where I need to go. I can't actually get to that elevator though because doors that can't be opened yet is an orange key. And there's an orange key that leads to it. But then at the same time, I don't really want to go back through this house. Ah, uh, not a house, I'm on a fucking ship. I don't want to go back through where I was. Because everywhere else leaded to nothing. This was the only place I could go forward. Ah, through this door. I knew that wasn't the way to go. So he literally just walked through this door and turned around and walked back through. Okay. There he is. Wait, there are more creatures this way. I found this though. Think we can use it? Yeah, uh, it yeah. just might do the trick. Definitely. Okay, what? Oh, for fuck's sake! There's another fucking herd there that I kind of want. Are you fucking kidding me with these boxes? I'm out. Oh, okay. Just don't grab me. These fucking boxes. Jesus. Go, 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 go. I'm currently out of, uh... Door's locked. I don't have any more decoys. What was that? Custom parts. They're in here. <laughs> hey yeah. <laughs> Ooh, item box. Retrieve stolen equipment. You can equip or switch weapons on the screen. You can also customize weapons if you have custom parts. Any weapon you obtain will be automatically added to the screen. Okay. You square to switch screens and change equip unequip. <laughs> uh... Oh yeah, these. Wait, what is this? Firepower, one fifty, one ninety. Uh, these guns here, I actually got. Um, I don't know how I got this. I just bought the game. It wasn't like a um. It wasn't like a special edition where you buy the game and you get certain in-game items. I just bought the regular edition of the game and then when I started it up, I had, um... I said I got given this, this, and this. Um... Capacity 10, 8, 4! Holy shit, 12. G A T. Wait, so can I just take... Oh, I can take all of them. Um, capacity, firing speed, 158. Wow, oh, that's firing speed super fast. That's one thing I noticed with this gun, is the firing speed is kind of small. Um, let's put this one back. And we'll take... And then this is to upgrade. I kind of want to upgrade. This is the strongest in regards to firepower. But the only sh thing is the capacity is... Oh no, the capacity is 30. Oh no, no, sorry. The capacity would be 4. You can only shoot 4 bullets at a time before you have to. Yeah, okay. Um... Ups the firepower by ten. Duh. 
actually, if that's the case, 190, 100, ups the firepower by 10. Uh, what is this? 150, that one's weak. The good thing about this gun is the firing speed, it's why I want it on there, and the capacity firepower. I might just have to put it on this one. Okay, I wonder if you can take it. Oh, okay, you can, so you can... Just because you equip it to a gun doesn't mean it's locked on there permanently. That's good. Okay. Uh, yep. So... Oh, it's badass. Okay, cool. I just can't really tell, like... Okay, this is the good one for the four. It's red and white. That's just black and brown. G18. Okay, now I can kind of get it. If I want the powerful one, yeah, that one, red and white. That's the G18. Yeah, okay. You got our equipment. Now what? Now we contact HQ and tell them what the hell is going on. We should be able to do that from the bridge. Let's go. This is the room I was stuck in. By the way, see you that guy in the castle. It's easy. I wonder if these use the same bullets. Under the bed. Yeah, I think at the end of the day, it's all it's all just uh, where's the G18? There we go. I want to try out this fast five out. I think at the end of the day, it's all just um, handgun ammo. Nothing in here. Oh, let me double check. Okay, so now that we got our guns. Um, now I kind of want to go back through and just kill everyone and then scan everyone. How many herbs do I have? Two. Trying to be snakey. Oh, the G18. There we go. So, I decided to use a grenade there because there's three of them right close by. Save my ammo a bit. Although they're all fucking. Uh, it's all good. I was going to say, uh, well, they're all going to get back up anyway, so I just. Uh, any uh, items? Oh. I still don't know what this uh, invite from GBL. Who sees me playing this? He probably wants to talk to me about it. Scan it up. Scan it up. Uh, fucking itchy back. Items. I'm loving this a lot so far. This revelations, just like the the feel of it, like the smoothness of it. Don't have a card for that. 
just like how it plays, even the story. I love that you're playing as like. Oh. Fuck! More custom parts. Ah, oh, fuck's sake! I'm gonna go back. Um, I love it that there's uh multiple campaigns, so you get to play as both Chris and and Jill. Um, the handling, the controls is so much better. It's shorter, which I suppose can be a bad thing, but in this case I'm kind of, because I'm playing every game sort of in a row, I sort of like, every game I've played so far has been like really long. So having a short one here and there doesn't, doesn't piss me off. Oh shit, I pushed the wrong thing. Fire rate on this one. I don't really like, uh, I don't really like sort of streaming, um, I don't really like streaming sometimes when he's, like, in the party chat, because a lot of the times he plays, like, what he does is he plays, like, the game, so the audio comes out through his TV, and then he has a headset on that he talks through. But his game audio doesn't come through his headset. It comes out through his TV, which you can, which comes in like through the background, which is kind of annoying. It's... So I didn't really want to stream this and then have his gameplay of whatever he's playing blaring in the background. It's kind of a kind of a distraction. Come on, Parker. Parky poo. I love the, uh, that's nothing I love about this game though, though, is, is like this thing here, which was like, okay, scan enemies, every enemy you come across, which, yeah, is kind of annoying. I mean, I don't think you have to, it's just a, like I said, I don't know what these pills think. I don't know what these pills are. Oh yeah, the fire rate on this G18 is so much better. But using this as well just to like... find items is such a big help. Yeah, I should have realized they used the ammo for all of them. Fuck, I need that shotgun. Okay, so... Ah, oh, we can go through...
Was it this way? No, it wasn't that way. It was this way. We can go through that door now. It's unlocked. I should have used the grenade on that one first. Oh yeah, we can shoot the... Oh wait, it was... I think it was that one. Was this the room I was in? Yeah, okay. Let's just ignore that room. No, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ignore it! Can you uh, do the honors? I'm kind of running low on ammo. Parker, can you shoot the lock? Parker, please, shoot the lock. I'm kind of low on ammo. No? Yeah, well. Ammo! Oh shit! I haven't been fucking... Fuck it, you know what? I'm gonna go in here because I didn't get a chance to scan it because I didn't have my scanner. Thank you. There we go. More ammo, please. Where's the item? Oh, that looks like... Wait, is that downstairs? What? Oh, another handprint. Okay, this looks like it's downstairs, hence why I can't pick it up. I thought it was like right here. I'm guessing the handprints are just like collectibles. <laughs> oh, thank god, an elevator. Is this, um... I'm not right in front of it though. Bridge lower cabins. Lower cabins. There's a weapon box there. Uh, I don't know what that orange diamond is. Fuck it, let's go to lower cabins first. And then I'll try and find that item. It was like sort of right in front somewhere, wasn't it? Herb. <laughs> Door unlocked. Ah, oh, that's it there. Hang on a minute. So... I should have already been through all of here. Yeah. That just leads you through to that door that was locked on the other side. Okay, so this is all done then. Except... 
Oh, yeah, the weapon box. That was the shotgun on the, um... Uh, that was the shotgun. Oh! And this leads back to... Okay, yeah, and that'll be the item box. Or the crafting thing, that squared. Okay. Because that's where it was, straight in through there. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna get to the bridges. Bridge. This is like the first Resident Evil game since I've started playing them all. Like from zero, where the controls have been like really good. Zero sucked. One was shitty. Uh, I'm not counting two and three remake because those are really good, but two and three originals I'm guessing were pretty shit. Uh, and then you had four. Code Veronica was the worst. I don't know. I love how all of the ammo is like the same from the other games. Like the the shotguns are always yellow and green. I think it all has the same logo and same like brand on it too. Same with the handgun. It's like red. Mag is black. I'm at the bridge. I'm getting like real Resident Evil and Resident Evil 7 vibes from this ship. Even some of the areas like this area here, with, like the, the bridge control, sort of looks the same. Handgun ammo case. I guess. Oh. <laughs> Fuck, it's so annoying. I want to read the shit that just pops up. Communication systems down. The thing we literally can't change our course. We're completely adrift. It literally pops up and it just disappears straight away. Use your ammo wisely. Oh. Don't tell me that was the tugboat. Shit, we'll be stuck here. Oh, who are you? Oh wait, that's the. He was in that cutscene with the the city. Yours, Parker. Because I remember his hair, and I was like thinking, what a stupid hairstyle. Dead. GBL playing Resident Evil Six. Episode two, double mystery. I actually um. <laughs> Hang on. Resident Evil Revelations walkthrough. I just want to see. I just want to see how many episodes are in this. Twelve. Okay. Shit. Oh, nice big gun. You can maybe knock out. We can maybe knock out like episodes one to four. Maybe uh. There's 12 episodes we can make each each stream maybe three episodes long so it'll work out to three streams four streams sorry i can't count 
three episodes. Or we could hit four. In which case then it will be three streams. Previously, Resident Evil, Evil Revelation. Jesus, no one could have lived through that. And stories of the resurrection are true. Then the setup that got Jill and Parker, it was all. <laughs> it's a trap. Yeah, I almost guarantee it. But Ryan, we'll go after Jill and Parker. Make your way to the Mediterranean. Where? Damn it. The bastard took all my weapons. Can you reach HQ? No, comms are as it seems. Shit, we'll be stuck here. Jim! Who the hell are you? Hurting, Cadet? No. I can still fight. That's the spirit. It's over. The city is finished. the heliport. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Cause. Surely you can understand that. I'm afraid I cannot. Obliterating the site by satellite is only a quick fix. We could lose crucial evidence. Use of the satellite has already been approved. We could clean up this mess. I guess you thought of everything. Even the FBC may not be able to cover its tracks on this one. Let the heavens scorch the earth with justice. These unilateral solutions of your earth will only create a new Velcro. Perhaps a dozen of them. I was yes. literally on mute that whole fucking time. Men like us can exist thanks to groups like that. And he'll just let all those people die. Are you finished now, Director O'Brien? Everyone, you have your orders. Move into position. Raymond, with me. Yes, sir. So you're Raymond, okay. You don't... Okay, uh, well, I did say, I don't know how long I was on fucking mute for. Who are you? Um, but I was saying, I do love how all the ammo is the same. Uh, the submachine gun ammo, Jackal, Blue Box, which is like the TMP in, uh, 
like the TMP ammo in um, Resident Evil 4. Uh, I do love how we're playing in a city now, in this Terra Grigia. Although I didn't think we'd be playing as this guy. And I got a fucking P90 up in this bitch. I'm so mad. Hunters. Oh, this P90 feels smooth. Where are we going? I can't play that map. I can't go out that way. How many are there? Did Veltro make them all? Can't contain this. The world can find out. Everyone will equate Veltro with terror. Which way are we going? Follow the blood. Ooh, nice backflip. Climb the walls too. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. Sorry to drag you into this. Yuck. What the? Brooke already? And that was the last working elevator. How do you feel about stairs? Actually, I'm not sure how I feel about stairs. Didn't mean to do that! <laughs> Take a swipe at it with my knife. Where am I going? I can't jump over there. I love this game. I fucking love this game. <clears throat> Blue card. I oh, know. The FBC's charter. The Federal Bioterrorism Commission was founded by the US government to be the enforcing agency of the guidelines set forth in the National Species Protection Act. This document outlines the FBC's charter and the responsibilities of its members. The FBC is charged with protecting the United States and her interests from biological threats. Our organization will work with other countries and their respective wildlife protection organs to guard public health. As such, we are tasked with ensuring the biological... safety of the public at large. The duties of all F FBC members include the research, training and support of the biological community. Policies will be fomented on a needs only basis with any additional budgets, expenditures and extraordinary activities being approved by a plenary session of the Wildlife Protection Committee. The FBC chair is selected by the Wildlife Protection Committee. The chair's duties include complete oversight of the FBC and coordination of all activities with respective U.S. Cabinet officials. The FBC Chair is the final overseer of the NAPC. All members of the NAPC are entitled to request help from the Chair, including the Secretary of State of Defense and the Nas Director of National Intelligence. However, the Chair has final authority on all the matters of national biological safety. Well, that was very boring to read. 
It's like nothing but government bullshit. But, uh, I, 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 I can't stand like, uh, I'm not one of those people that plays games like this and just like, any diet. Turn around! Any game with like backstory with like dialogue and shit like that, I'm always like wanting to read. Like I'm not one of those players that can just... I see shit like that. You see other people do it as well. Oh, now you're telling me how to swap weapons. You see other people do it as well where they pick something up. Even if it's like a little bit of dialogue, they're like, ah, oh, I don't care. Like, oh, just read it. Backstory. The lore. It just so happened that one I just read right there was, in particular, was pretty boring. But in general, most of them are really good. Unless you're playing Outlast, I have max herbs. If you're playing Outlast, uh, Outlast 1 isn't too bad, but Outlast 2. If you play Outlast 2 and you pick up all of those sheets of paper and read every single one, God bless you, because it is just like... It is like just babble. It's like just uh, blah 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 prophets so, and what do you think about that sacrifices guy? and it's just like I don't want to be rude, but church like uh, church babble and all of it just like makes no sense. It's, it's a total waste of time. It doesn't lead to like the story or nothing. Oh, okay. So when they're down like that, I should just punch them to save some ammo. Duly noted. I can't believe I was on mute. I have no idea how long I was on mute for. Doesn't look like I can get through here. Hopefully it wasn't too fucking long. There's no point in starting the whole fucking episode, I don't know. Okay, ignore it. This game feels like uh, so polished as well compared to 4. Like just the look of it as well. And I love that I'm getting to explore, like, I mean, the ship, I don't know if, I did say it when I, I don't know if I was muted or not when I said it, but when I was playing on that ship, I was getting a lot of RE7 vibes, um, which at the end of RE7, or well, midway through RE7, when you go to the ship where Eevee was, um, Ow. But um, I do love that I'm getting to play in all these different areas of the ship, like the city here, the snow with um, snowy mountains is Chris. What was that? Come this way. We can get through here. Give me a hand. Okay, I'm coming. For the love of God! Jessica, hurry! Turn around and help her! No, they just suddenly stopped. How kind of them. Oh, they just... Oh, okay, they just stopped just to let us through. That was so kind of them. 
bastards! Look, this holds them! Come on, the elevator's just ahead. Yes. Yes. Reload. Can't go wrong with a good P90. More shotgun ammo. Herb? Oh wait, no, I think I'm full on herbs, yeah. the fucking hunters oh hey jump in front of me aren't you smart back off oh wow, I didn't even hit it whatever is this thing here yet Fucking hoppy little bastards, aren't ya? All of that ammo I just picked up. Oh god. Jesus Christ, can this lift hurry up? I shot that one on the way down. Alright, reload, 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 ow. Alright, I picked that herb up now. Finally! Holy shit! Go, go, go! Get off me. Go, 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 go! Jesus, I thought it was gonna stop again! Yeah, we're fine. But that was crazy. I can't believe Morgan decided to fry the city with the solar energy satellite. Wiped off the face of the earth. By tomorrow morning, Terra Grigia will be just a name in a history book. This Resident Evil is like, uh. There's not a lot of. Actually, I don't think I've come across any puzzles yet in this. I hope a lot of the older Resi games sort of have puzzles. Well, or even the newer ones as well, like RE7. <laughs> when have I ever gone back on my work? This one's just all straight, um, straight action. Which apparently five and six are like a lot, are like big on action as well. I wonder if there's like puzzles and shit in those. So this must be right before the, uh, yeah, I was going to say, right before the uh, satellite wipes it out. Much like um, Raccoon City.
Terra Grigens. No more. We came to help, but did nothing. Arrive, destroy city, leave. That's you. He's a bad shot. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just watching this clip of this fucking racist a bitch someone late. put on Twitter. What is the FBC doing here? <laughs> answer me, Raymond. I don't have to answer anything. It's... You have no authority over this. There's no time to fight. We've got to give it a rest. I don't even know why you're here or who you're fighting. Raymond, stop right there. Nothing will change, unless you get your hands dirty. So the FBC is on this ship too. What's going on here? We're operating without any intel. We need to search this ship for answers. Not that I relish the idea. So, um, hmm. so I wonder what the hell we need to even do on the ship now, now that we already know Chris isn't on the ship. Oh, hang on. No, we came through that door before. Let me just double check this. Surely there's going to be something on here. Yep. And Granada. Hello, mother. Hello, father. I am here at Camp Granada. Oh, yeah, I need to remember. I just have. I need to remember. I just. I don't have, like. Everyone else I've been using has got, like, shotguns, machine guns. She's just got the three pistols, so. Granada. Can't go through there. We must have to go back up to the cabins at some point because... Helm key. Um, what was it? Oh, it was an anchor. Yeah. Like, we still don't have the anchor key here and there's like anchor doors up in the cabins. So I'm guessing we can have to go back up there at some point. Um... I mean, so far this game seems like it's uh, sort of um, open world. Ship layout. For all staff and crew, the Queen Zenobia is a pleasure cruise liner that provides world-class service with the comfort of a luxury hotel. 
for our passengers. The ship offers numerous services and facilities for our guests. As a representative for the ship, it is your job to be familiar with all the facilities that can be found here. The following list outlines some of the major facilities on the ship. Please read each one carefully. Promenade Hall. Boasting an area of 1,500 squared, the ship is promenade. The ship's promenade hall has three floors and is more spacious than any other ship in the world. The interior is done in a Gotham, in a Goth, <laughs> the interior is done in a Gothic style with ceilings covered in chandeliers. Its beauty and style rivals that of the finest opera houses. Casino, the ship's casino can be found next to the promenade hall. All kinds of gaming pleasures await our guests, including card games and slot machines. Everything guests would expect from a casino can be found here 24 hours a day. Restaurants and shops. Promenade Hall is designer goods and brand name stores from all over the world. Guests can relax in our many restaurants and bars. There are also shops that cater to our guests' everyday needs. Emergency communication room. There is an emergency communication room next to the promenade that can be used as a safety point during an emergency. Crew can also use this room to transmit an emergency distress call should the need arise. Solarium. The shuttered glass of the solarium overlooks the world's largest onboard swim pool. This romantic spot has been a favorite destination for many of our passengers. Uh, be on the lookout for couples who sneak in after hours. Oh, after they get the little freaky deaky. Okay, so now I can go through... Did I scan you? I can't remember. I did. Okay, so... The map. Where am I? I'm down here. There's a box close by, I'm guessing, through here. There was another helm door somewhere. Discarded message. Oh God, please help me. This can't be happening. Don't leave me to die in this hell. I'm trapped here. Every uh, There are monsters here. Real ones. Everyone's dead or dying. There are no survivors. Shit, we're all going to die. Oh, page 2 or 2 was the message. Okay. Sir? Is that a map? Yeah. Wow, complete map of the whole ship. We should find an emergency communication room if we go through the hall. Put that crest. Oh, that's to get the shotgun. You're not gonna attack me, eh? More reading. It is law. History of the Queen Zenobia. Tonnage, 148,000 gross tonnage, displacement, length, beam, height, compulsion, pass crew, 1,094 officers crew, passengers, 2,200. This Pragwas Line flagship was constructed in 1978. The interior is designed to replicate that of ships of the 1930s, the golden age of cruise ships. The design was based on blueprints left by George Trevor before his disappearance. Newspapers from the time of the ship's construction report accolades the design received. Why does that name George Trevor sound familiar? The ship herself was named after Zenobia, the queen of the Palmyrene Empire, who was disposed by the Romans. Like the legendary beauty of her namesake, the ship is also known as the Beauty of the Atlantic and remained one of the most popular cruise ships built in the 20th century. With the rise of air travel supplanting the popularity of long seafaring voyages, Looks like the Queen Zenobia, along with her sister ship, was destined to be junked in the late 80s. Fortunately, she was purchased by the Pragwas line and her stream turbines were replaced with an electric diesel propulsion system. Her holding cabin areas were expanded and she was upgraded with the latest technology. The Queen Zenobia was reborn as a fully functional luxury liner. After its restoration, the Queen Zenobia set out on a cruise around the world, followed by one of around South America and many, many others. In the future, she will find her main harbour in the Mediterranean for her cruises around Africa. The Queen Zenobia will be bringing pleasure to passengers for years to come. History of the Queen Zenobia. Ah, 
Oh, yeah, it's disgusting. Yeah, it's disgusting. You're not gonna jump me, are you? How horrible. That must have been a painful death. Oh. Item found inside his body? Shotgun shells! Did you swallow some shotgun shells? I always wish games would like... In games when you're like walking around with someone else, right? Like a companion like this. Or a teammate or whatever. I wish there was like... I wish they would add dialogue every now and then. I mean, some games do, but... When it's just sort of like missions like this, it's sort of like... Really? Really? We're just gonna... We're just gonna run around here in complete silence, just ignore each other? Oh! Maybe try to contact HQ. Oh, ask and I shall receive. Uh, where was that other helm door? That's a card reader, can't go there. Alright, we've got to find Raymond. How do you know him? I used to work with him. Let's leave it at that. Please tell me more. Ah, oh, reload! Blast the fire right there we go. <laughs> oh! Ah, oh, come on. We're heading back. Downstairs. Wait, were we supposed to go? It shows me there's an item box down here. I have another upgrade as well. Oh, wait, this is the lift. This map isn't really, um, it isn't really that detailed. Oh, I can zoom. Yeah, shows there's like a... Oh, I don't know. I do not know. I don't get it. Um, I'm probably just gonna go to... Oh, that was the lift. Oh, it's not working. Okay, that wasn't the lift. Um, I'm guessing I might find that other helm door. This must be the way to go anyway, because that enemy spawned there. This is the lift. Um, 
It would have been upper caverns, wouldn't it? You got a friend in need. Here it is here. Uh, I can also grab that shotgun too. Illegal custom parts. Ooh, what could that be? Note found in room 303. What the hell is going on? Monsters are crawling all over the ship. They're tearing it to pieces. I've never seen monsters like this. Their movements are stiff, stilted, but it's all over if they get a hold of you. Not necessarily. I've been grabbed a few times. Those piece of shit monsters ate my friend Hassan. Bastards. I used my gun to frighten them off, giving me time to get the hell out of there. The bullet went straight through its arm. Thank God these monsters have bones like an old woman. There's no end left to run now. Damn monsters twisted my leg good. Hell, I've run out of ammo too. God only knows how I'm going to survive this. Well, fucking pistol whip them. You said their bones are like grandmas. Okay, double check. I'm sure a good pistol whip. Break a couple of bones. If they're soft and brittle. And brittle. I have no idea where the fuck I'm going, by the way. I don't even know where the fuck I am. I can go through that door now. Um, the shotgun, I believe, was on the lower cabins, wasn't it? Yeah. Fuck, I might actually get that first. Because uh, I feel like this is the way I need to go. Lower cabins. Is there anything in here? Okay, so the shotgun is close by. Oh. I didn't even notice you were gone. Where the fuck did you come from? Is it in here? That's the toilet. Upgrade the pistol. I wonder what the illegal is. Oh, so what do we got? Damage and burst rifle. Fires two consecutive shots with one trigger pull. Damage two ups the firepower by 20. Ah, uh, the firepower could be 228 for this. Let's put it on this one. Burst. Uh, I don't really like burst guns. If I was going to put it on, though, it wouldn't be this, because only, it's only 4 capacity. That's 12, but the I love the fire speed, so I just spam the fire button on that. Might as well put it on this one, I think. The Samurai Edge.
Oh, the card reader. I have this now. Do I have this now? No? Ow! It wasn't this way. I'm back upstairs. Oh my god, the fuck is this gun? So you can, yeah. So you can basically go between levels through the staircase or the elevator. That's not a helm key, though, is it? It's the, yeah, it's the anchor. This is what's confusing because it shows I'm by the box. But the box is on the other way, it's on the other side of this. Maybe that orange diamond isn't the box. See, the box is right here, but when I pull out the map, I'm nowhere near it. There's the orange diamond there. I'm the blue circle. And it shows the weapon room was around here somewhere. This was the toilet. Yeah. And this is the elevator. Oh no, wait a minute. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Wait, where am I? No, this is the weapon box. The gun, yeah, weapon box. Box. So what the fuck is that then? I just presumed the weapon was the, the shotgun. Hence why I couldn't find it. Okay. Well, in that case, I might be on the... Uh... Let's go back to the elevator. Such a dingus. Elevator up here. The elev uh, the uh, what are we on now? Lower cabins. It might have been in the upper cabins then. Oh shit! Did I just leave without Parker? I'll run through all of these fucking rooms if I have to. Uh, that's where I wake up. <clears throat> yeah, it must have been upper because I saw... 
I saw that shotgun when I had no weapons at all. Scan complete. Full. See, I don't even know what these pills are. Because remember, I I came across that. Have I been in the spa? I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, I came across that shotgun when I didn't have my weapons back, so I was still evading everyone. Because I saw the shotgun and I was like, oh, I wish I had that. There it is. Fucking hell. Okay. So now we can put that in there. Picked up the Wyndham. Yeah, I know how to change weapon. Oh. I might ask Jeeves what these pills are for. Under the map, see where it says I got five of whatever that is, pills? The funny thing is, also, it's like, it shows it here next to the herb. Every time you scan a dead body, you keep scanning till you hit a hundred percent, then you get a pill. See, it shows up here herb and a pill, but I don't know what the pill's for. Okay, so now that we got all that, um, oh, where's the map? Okay, so now we need to go, oh, fuck, how the hell do we get there? And what items do I have? Yeah, the helm key, I still need the, uh, Let me just... He doesn't know. He doesn't know what the fuck I'm talking about. This, does this lead to the, uh, I see a staircase here. Yeah, I think this leads to the, um, the cafeteria. Yeah, okay. Um, but now I don't know where... That's the anchor door. Oh, I can go through here now, because it's white. That's this thing. Oh, that's the helm key as well. Okay. Interesting door. He still has no idea. Is it actually... Oh. I'll wait till I kill another enemy. Oh. This is what I call a cruise ship. It's like an opera house in here. So, 
Where is this emergency communication? Man, everyone has to go on a... That's, that's crazy how the camera pans out like that. Um... I'm get uh I'm getting like RE one vibes here. Everyone needs to go on a cruise ship in their life at least once. Nice looking ship. It would have been nicer to be on it without all the monsters. He just sent me something. It gives you a free green herb every time you complete it at 100%. There is a guide about Genesis in the menu section. I see a percentage increase when I scan, but not sure of the purpose. Wait a minute. Do I need to reread this Genesis manual? Uh, bounces, special energy, radio, office, and all analyze it. It is possible to detect analyze. It has been possible to be able to uh, Using synchrotron radiation, it is possible to detect specific items. The data for bullets, medicinal herbs, are uh, registered within the internal memory for testing. If it's just just nearby, then you know, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Doesn't say anything about. Casino. Oh, let's gamble. Oh, I need the anchor mark. How do I? How do you know this is the anchor? I went on a cruise ship to. Um... Oh, I see it. I went on a cruise ship to Vanuatu uh, for like 10 days. First ever time on a cruise ship. Fucking unbelievable. They literally have like, uh, so they have like all the actual like fancy restaurants and shit on there that you have to pay to like go to. Um, but they also have like this food hall where every single day they make like uh, and they will change every, uh, every day before you can go there for breakfast and they have like they have like everything like literally everything all the every cereal you can think of eggs bacon toast sausages spaghetti baked beans waffles fucking pancakes everything that goes with it a uh, ton of fruit and then like lunchtime they will have uh the lunch usually changes because breakfast is breakfast right but lunch they'll always like they'll rotate it throughout the days and same for dinner as well but they'll have like uh i have no idea where i'm going they'll have like just one night for dinner it was like roasts right so, but they have like uh, like roast beef, roast lamb, roast pork, roast chicken, um, with all like roasted veggies, um, like roast potatoes, roast kumra, and then they'll also have like other dishes with like uh, um, like uh, like a like a um, shepherd's pie. They'll add like a bunch of other random dishes with it, and then another night will be pasta night, for instance. They'll be mac and cheese like macaroni cheese like chicken carbonara chicken bacon fettuccine and then they'll again they'll now add like side dishes like a uh, garlic bread and fucking mashed potato it's just it's just fucking full on and then like lunchtime will sort of be like hot dogs hamburgers and all that all that is free that's just the general food hall it's all like included in your price of admission to get on the ship it's just if you want to go to the fancy restaurants where you 
sit down and um, you know get given a menu and order something that's what you have to pay for but the general food hall you literally just grab a plate help yourself and eat it and boom you're done you can go back up for seconds if you want it it's fucking crazy it reminds me of uh, solarium it reminds me a bit of like like when you go watch the um, like the Harry Potter movies right and then they sit down in the Great Hall for like breakfast or like their Halloween feast or like their Christmas dinner and then Dumbledore will be like enjoy and then he just like snaps his fingers and all this food just appears on the table and you just help yourself to whatever you want crazy And then everything else that goes with, you know, being on a cruise, just chilling out, just exploring different countries and shit. Why'd the music stop? Question. One, is that a tongue? And two, am I about to fight a fucking dragon? What is this? Place? Oh god. Okay. I thought this was a dragon. I was like, what the fuck? I thought it was like the back or the, like, the top of a dragon. Dragons and Resident Evil don't necessarily make sense. Uh... Oh, it's in a swimming pool. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, you just scared of that. There's no way I'm getting in that. Don't want to go diving in there. lunch they would usually have like hot dogs hamburgers hot chips uh, and then of course they'd have healthy stuff like salads like egg salad potato salad like regular salad with like the lettuce and the diced tomatoes and carrot and boiled egg and cheese and stuff um, they'd have like shit tons of sandwiches they'd have like a whole like smorgasbord of like different meats like cold meats um, that you just help yourself to with like and like bread whatever bread you want white brown raisin bread margarine butter heaps of like uh spreads as well for breakfast as well spreads like you know vegemite peanut butter peanut butter crunchy different ranges of like ja uh, jam I don't understand how this works. Like, how do you know where to put what thing where? See, what causes that 
What causes that to change the light? You just keep... Maybe you just keep moving it all around until... Oh, wait, I need to move this one. Because it goes straight down to this one. So let me move this one. Oh, wait, I, okay, I think I know what to do. I think you just need to pass it through all of the... Like, all of the nodes. But it stops there. Like that. Oh, fucking reset. See, how do you know what the starting point is? Oh, wait a minute. These have the yellow circles in the middle. These two don't, and these two are flashing. That one's not flashing. Okay, so I, th I think I get it now. So these... Yeah, now the light comes on. Okay, so I think what you have to do is you have to get all the lights on in the middle. All the yellow circles on in the middle, and have the, the bar be orange. In that case, that goes there. None of them can be in the middle, though. They all have to be down here. Because if you bring them all down, see all the yellow lights are up here? take it back when I said this game doesn't really have puzzles. <laughs> I think I get it. I think I get it now. I think... Hang on. See if I take this one. Fuck. This thing's blocking it. That, and let's just move this here, this here, this one I think needs to go up. Here we go, like that. Okay. Jesus Christ. Another handprint. I'll be able to purify the pool for this. Is that going to wake up whatever the thing, whatever the hell that was? Filtration's going to take a while. Should have not. I'll come back later. Now what? He did say come back later. But he also said we had to go to the... Yeah, the emergency communication room. 
that's the good thing about this area here, this big round part. I know straight away like what it is. It's that big, uh, yeah, the big hall. And just knowing you can go down to any level. God forbid we can take the lift. Shows we're like smack in the middle, but also it is on this level. Get on my level. Maybe through here. No, left in front of the emergency communications room. This is the emergency communication room. No one gets in without my permission and not without my key. If you want to come find me in my usual spot on the promenade deck, your comms officer. There's a message scrawled underneath. This is crap. The ship is crawling with freaks and monsters. I'm going to the promenade. Because at least I can find food there. Anyone who's still alive can meet me up there. You know where to find me. I'm not going out like that. I can promise you that. Hope I'm not the only survivor. You're a friendly neighborhood comms officer. So where is he? Oh, no, wait. This is the message scrawled. Going to the promenade. Promenade deck is next to the hall. Go. We should be able to find the key. Promenade deck. There's another gun box down there too. So yeah, ground floor. Promenade, oh promenade. I'm probably going to leave it after this episode. I don't really want to leave it till the end of episode... F Wait, what episode are we actually on? I think we're on three, aren't we? I don't want to leave it at the end of episode four because... Um... Oh, there you are. I'm jumping back on at four o'clock with... Uh, the suicide of Rachel Foster and I sort of... I want to charge my headset, my controller, before I jump on before then. Had a feeling that wasn't going to work. What was that? A gunshot? Who's out there? Oh, I see a sniper rifle. Ah. Fuck, how do you zoom? It doesn't... It says something zoom in the bottom left. The... the rifle ammo, red and white. Um, I need to get to the ammo box so I can put my shotgun in there so I can... Looks like we found the promenade deck. <laughs> get out of the way, Parker! One shot. Pog. Oh, help if I reloaded my weapon. Oh, don't even need to do anything. You got it, Parker. Target practice. Okay, this is taking too long. We 
have yet to find one survivor. Oh, what is that? I hear big boy thuds. Where's that weapon box? In the corner. I feel like I can get it. Oh, it's right here. Long magazine. Fire rate. Okay, so... Oh, the shotgun's already in here. Okay. I thought I would have had to put the gun back in the box and then walk back to the shotgun, which I left on the floor. Okay, that's helpful. Uh, well, in that case... Uh, well, in that case... Wait, what upgrades do I have? Fire rate? Long magazine. Long magazine's the capacity, isn't it? Yeah, four to five. Definitely put it on that. The fire rate. Put it on this, why not? Um, but still, I just only want one pistol, and then if I got these two weapons. Uh, let's just put this on. I should have upped the capacity on this, maybe. Big boy thuds. Oh, fucking one behind me. Get up. Get up. What the fuck? What? Why don't you get up? Use the gas cylinders temporarily. Oh, I already blew one of those up. But... I didn't know there's gonna be one fucking right behind me. Well. First fucking death. Emergency call number. How about we just leave it in there? Mayday, mayday. Where the fuck did that one come from behind? This is the Queen Chinobi. Come out there, mate. There's an item in the room.
Come on, 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 come on. Oh, fucking dead end. They're just spawning right behind me. I got no more throwables. I see a little head thing on the... Oh my god, wiggle! Oh sweet, you jumped straight down. What the fuck is this?! Man, I really need my other fucking pistol. The faster fire rate one. Oh, it spits those out. I'm not responsible for Parker, am I? Oh, that's not the time! Give me a catch-up. Holy shit! Oh my god! Back up, Parker! You fucking idiot! Ah! 
Yeah, I'll get right on it. I need to get this cunt that's firing shit. Life boy key. Saving. Fuck! Is that the key to the emergency communication room? Yeah. Let's leave this monster infested hell hole. Scan the uh, trap. Holy shit! Okay. That's that door there. And life boy doors over here. Exit. Before we hit the exit. Oh, this leads you into a whole new area. Puzzle time, puzzle time. Yeah, see the, the lights change. So this time they're here and here. Oh, that was easy. Yeah. Elevator. I don't really want to go in the elevator just yet. Okay, so that's the elevator. So I want to come back over here. Ah, oh, I see that leads you behind. Oh, wait, that just leads you back. Also, there seems to be no, um, there doesn't seem to be any crafting in this either, like, uh, like, you know what I mean, craft green herb with green, with yellow herb, or like green herb with red herb. Bing! Where do we go now? Bridge deck. Where am I going? Four deck. Four deck. Uh, and there's a gun box. I haven't been to the four deck. There's a gun box at the side deck. Freight lift. Uh, oh, yeah. Did we get the... um? Where do we try to go through? Oh, the communications room, and we needed the key. Yeah, so we still don't have the key for that, do we? But it still says that's where we need to go. Um, let's just go to the deck. Is this the... This will be the front deck, eh? The fore deck? Or are we on the side deck? No, we're on the fore Okay. Rifle ammo. Grenades! 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 Fuck, I wish I had that during that fight. More health. Oh, 
buy them in the rubbish bin, eh? Magnum ammo! Get one of those soon. Don't have a card. There's a card holder as well. Oh, it was actually a waste of time coming here, wasn't it? Is there anything out here? Nope. There literally is nothing else in here, is there? Oh, what is this? Card reader as well. Ah, uh, okay. Well... Oh, maybe we could go through the... Oh, shit, sorry. Maybe we, um... Maybe we can go through the... Communications room door. Maybe um, we needed the boy key to get through there. I just presumed you needed the uh, the actual key that says communications room on it. I thought we were going to pick up like a communications key room. Communications room key. I'm not turning back now. Oh wait, we have to go this way. Wait, are we basically just stuck here? We came from over here. Oh, you're probably gonna you, oh, you probably have to go to the bridge and then go all the way back around. That's annoying. So promenade's a dead end then. Bridge. Deck was a dead end. Quit staring at my ass. Okay, so if we go to the bridge on here. Oh wait, there's a boy room right here. Wait, we've been in here. Oh wait, I picked up that thing during the boss fight, didn't I? Uh this one it was this one communications officers journal day one I made the right decision coming up to the promenade I got food and beverages to last me a long time so this is the guy that scribbled the note I can still hear those things out there clawing on my door or looking for prey too bad they ain't getting in here I have no idea if anyone is, else is still alive but I know I'm going to make it through this alright day two shit those damn things got in through the air ducts but I put them all down before they could do any real damage. I've trained for this, and I trained hard. Hats off to me. Good thing I was up when it happened. No more deep sleeps for me. Day three. After yesterday's surprise party, I haven't been able to sleep a wink. My nerves are frayed. I wish I wasn't the only one here. Pretty tired today. I don't feel well. I better not get sick. I shouldn't move. Need to conserve energy. Just hang in there. 
I think this is day four. I got a fever. I hope those monsters don't find me like this. I'm so out of it. Am I infected? Is it just a cold? There's a big lump on my head. It hurts. Wish I had someone to talk to. So alone. It's so alone. How many days is it? I found someone to talk to. So happy. He's very funny. Tells lots of jokes. Lots. They're funny. I laugh. Laugh. His face is too close. In my face. Oh, I don't like where this is going. He thinks... He thinks so too. No room to move. Had a fight. He wanted all the foods. He was eating meat. Good tasty meat. I saw his face. Chewing. Eating. No meat for me. He looked tasty. His head looked... His head looked tasty. Help. Can't move. Trap. Me. Not me. Who is me? Please help. Please help. Mayday. 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 Meat. Meat. Eat. 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 Meat. Okay. This guy's obviously lost the fucking plot. Um... <laughs> Where the fuck am I going? So, what's the name of this big... The hall. That's where I need to get. That's where I need to get to. Okay. Oh, yeah, we went back up the stairs in the bridge. Um, by, like, the main... Yeah, these steps here. And then we worked our way all the way through. Is that still there? Yes. Thank you. Good thing I got a fucking 2000 IQ memory. Cap up. Up a cap. You coming? Uh. From there we went upper cabins. Because that's where I, I thought the shotgun was on the lower cabin, was the upper cabins. And then we go to the other elevator. And then take that to... It wouldn't be in here, this is just a room. Okay. Basically, any time it says room and a number, I can just ignore. Like this room right here. Ignore. I'm surprised they haven't put any enemies here in front of me. Maybe, oh, room 302. Maybe if I was playing on a higher difficulty, they probably would. Oh no, we didn't take the elevator there. No, that's right. We went to the we went to the cafeteria and went through the the doors. Yeah. And then we went We still need that anchor key. And then we went through here. No wait, this must be chapter 4, right? Or oh, episode 4. So episode 1 was we were her. We were playing as uh, Jill. Episode 2 we played as Chris. Episode 3 we played as... Slapnuts over here. Or am I just thinking incorrectly? End of episode? How did you get through there if I had the key? Looks like we both were too late. What are you talking about? Huh. Ignorant creatures who do not yet know of us. Both of you. 
Look. I will be that renewed. The desperate grief wrings my heart already. Even my good <laughs> friend. The guy looks like a fat Norman Reedus. My words be seed that may bear fruit of infamy to the traitor whom I know. I reckon this dude is the uh, the old dude in the um, cutscenes. He just looks different. I know not who thou art, nor by what mode thou hast come down here. The world is in our hands. This is the tea of this virus, and we are equipped to infect one fifth of. It is, because he gave them the. He gave him that vial. Unless he just took it off the old guy. Oh, God. Oh, Piranhas. <laughs> He's turning guppies into jaws. Shh, quiet. And even a child could guess what will happen next. Tell me to shush. Is it? Vengeful messengers for the depths of the inferno. I don't know the character's name, though. So this is our man. I knew it was Veltro. Abandon hope, all ye who oh, I don't think it is. I think it's just another random. Abandon hope? He's quoting Dante. Send a team to Valcoin and Mock Airport. Look for something linked to this ship, O'Brien. Yes, I read you. I'll send Quint and Keith. What? You two. Get ready to move. Oh, I hate snow. <laughs> snow hates you. How can you hate Find the snow? Out anything you can on Veltro. Snow is awesome. Sitting in these two dweebs. I don't see a thing. I thought the Mediterranean was just like a big lake. Be patient. Finding a ship at sea is like finding a needle in a haystack. No kidding. But that still doesn't solve our problem. Hey, are you even listening? We'll find you, Jill. I promise. Yeah, so the last time Chris was with Jill would have been uh, Resident Evil 1. When we entered Spencer's mansion? Is it Spencer? with Wesker. Oh, that was episode 3. 92%. I died the one time through bullshittiness. Through utter bullshittiness. I'm gonna, anyway, I'm gonna leave the episode here. Uh, so yeah, I, I feel like every, every stream will knock out three episodes. Uh, I've currently been going... Three hours, twenty minutes. Yeah, that's all right. Defeat 150 enemies for campaign use. Wait, did I act, did I get that, or is it telling me I can get that? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna head off. Uh, I'm gonna charge my controller and my headset for what's the time? Two o'clock. Yeah, for two hours, and then I'll jump back on at four in two hours time for the suicide of Rachel Foster. I'm enjoying this a lot. This is... This is probably like my favorite Resi game so far since I've played played them all. I don't think, I don't think it beats 7. 7 will always be my favorite. on Resident Evil Revelations. Hey, that's you. That's He's good. It has that previously on Revelations. No, Hopefully it plays fight. that uh, next time uh, when we come back everything. so it gives us like Even a refresher. May not be able to tracks on this one. Yeah, I thought the guy behind the mask was that old guy, but I don't I think it is. Scorched the earth with justice. Racking city all over again. Enteric regions. No more. Looks like we both were too late. Both of you. Look. Abandon hope, all ye who enter here. Abandon hope? He's quoting Dante. I'll find you, Jill. I promise.
Episode 4, Nightmare Revisited. We are Veltro, vengeful messages for the depths of the Inferno. I just want to see who we play as and where we're at. Terrorists. We killed these bastards already. It looks like you missed a few. And they're on this ship. And now they want to use the virus to stage another attack. They seek the truth about Terra Grigia and vengeance. Okay, we're back as these two and back on the ship. Okay. Oh, oh. Anyway, that's it. Uh, the comm system needs the main power. We need to bring the engine room back online. That won't be easy. Cool, if you can stop talking. Um, yeah, so that's going to be it. I'll be back on in two hours' time for the Suicide Erectual Foster. Um, probably going to smash that out in one hit, if I'm being honest. I think it's only like three hours long, three and a half hours long. Um, but yeah, again, this is Revel, Revel, Revel. This is Resident Evil Revelations. Loving it a lot. Um, yeah, current plan is, I think, if there's 12 episodes, so we'll just smash out three episodes every time we jump on. So there should be four, four total. And then we can start Resident Evil 5, which I already have, and Resident Evil 6, which I already have. But I still need to get Revelations 2. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. I'm Kata, and I'm out.